All right, so as you can see, the uh, battery light is flashing, even though I charged it for several hours and the charger light turned to green. Uh, but I wanted to show you the, the connection issue that I have here. So right now it says search for vehicle. And as you can see, there is no LED or Bluetooth light indicator on the front. So I'm gonna hit search for vehicle. And we're gonna pick the vehicle there. And it should tell me there's an error with the firmware when it first connects. There you go. Abnormal firmware detected, please fix it. And then it goes away. This only happens on an iPhone. On an Android phone, it tells me to fix the firmware and then it kicks me out of the of the thing and tries to connect again. Here at least it stays connected, even though there's nothing I can do much on here. Um, for example, batteries shows zero for the battery. If I go over to the settings, I can hit diagnose and it says everything's good. If I do it again, I'm gonna get diagnose failed and that's just gonna keep happening, diagnose failed. Every once in a while I get an okay and then it failed. So it seems to be connected. Um, if I try to change any settings, for example, let me go here and I'll change it to off-road. You'll see that that'll try for a second and then it'll say failed minus one. And that's usually the error I get, failed minus one. Uh, firmware upgrade, if I click on that, it's gonna go to loading, show me that it's already on the latest version. So the one thing I did notice, and maybe this has to do from when I first tried to install it, because when I first did the update, it said there was new firmware. I hit update firmware. When it was done, it said hit OK to restart. And that's when I started having the issues. If I go to about car and you look here at the settings, the main board, the driver board and the Bluetooth. Bluetooth says zero, zero, zero. I don't know if that's part of what's causing the problem. Uh, remaining capacity is 0%, voltage is 0, 0, And if I go down and look at the battery information, but right here, same thing, zeros all the way. Um, all right, so, but just to show you it works, it's actually connected. I'm gonna go to this first screen here and you can see that right now, let me move the phone away. You can see that now the Bluetooth is actually connected. There's a little blue dot right there. I'm gonna go ahead and hit the power button and you'll hear, you'll see that the wheel shuts off. And that's what it does. So now the wheel's off. I'm gonna give it a second here until the battery stops blinking and then I'm gonna plug it in and that's when you should hear the regular error that I'm getting when I turn it on, which says, please repair. They'll say that over and over. Um, anyways, let me give it a second here until this disconnects completely. And then I'll try that. There we go. So I'm gonna take the charger, which is currently in green because it's not being, it's not charging anything. Currently it shows green. That right there so you can see it. Now when I first plug this in, it is gonna be red for a while. Uh, and, and then eventually it turns green, almost like it has a full charge. Please repair. And she'll say please repair about three or four times. Please repair. Please repair. Please repair. Now in this mode, the wheel will move forward and backwards. I haven't tried to ride it, um, but the wheel will go forward and backward. Uh, I'm gonna turn it on here. Oh, I guess it's not gonna work because it's charging. Let me, take, let me unplug this and turn it on. I wanna show you that, see it does balance. And if I use that, I can tilt it any direction I want. I'm going to tilt it a little bit. You see that it comes right back. It won't let me move it forward. I'll let go. All 
There you go. Now I have the reason I have it all taken apart is because I'm waiting on a control board to pop this guy open and take it apart and switch out the control board. Hopefully that fixes the problem.